Okay, we just finished dinner from Moti, and there is a picture which we're about to unveil. Ben just brought that. How you doing, Ben? Good. A lot of work went into this project. We're hoping it turns out <coughs> perfectly. <laughs> and good. Don's got the hammer. Don, I'll let you unwrap that. And now Don is about to open the package, which contains the painting, the or the, the photograph that Ben took. The painterly photograph. The painterly, painterly photograph. photograph. We'll check back in as soon as Don gets a little bit further into this opening process. And the package is slowly being opened right now. And there it is. Let's turn it around here. Oh, wow. That is beautiful and unique. Ben, where did you take that this, picture? The, the garden I mentioned where I was yesterday, Rikugien. And I, I found the tree, it's still there. Explain explain how you took this picture, Ben. Well, and why does it, it look like a, it does? It was a stormy afternoon. And it's a very long exposure. So that the, uh, the Momiji leaves just swirl. How long was the exposure? I think this was um, a half second. Really? And I soaking wet. You were soaking wet. <laughs> what do you think? Brilliant. Brilliant. What do you think, Don? I love it. Well, <laughs> I bought it, so I'm not going to it. I knew they would do a beautiful job with the printing. It's done by Shashin Kosha, the mm -hmm. number one photo lab in Japan. Yeah. Little ad there. Didn't I see this picture in your book? Yes. Yeah. Very small. Yeah. Very. I, it's I, never been used effectively until 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 now. this. Now, is yeah. this available oh, I for? Your photo, I saw it in your show in Ginza. Yeah. yeah. There was a smaller version in the exhibition. Ah. I did see it in this book, though, right there. Okay. This is Ben's book. Can we see the cover of that book? Here is good. There we go. What's the name of this picture, Ben? Well, I would just say that it's um, Rikugien Momiji, you know, the maple. Momiji. Yeah. I, it's my theory that Rikugien Garden has the most elegantly shaped maple trees anywhere in Japan. There's Beautiful. something there's something unique about them. They've all got these these um, gnarled gnarled, and they have all these elbows on the on the limbs. Mm -hmm. Just just incredible. But the lighting on the limbs themselves, aside from the motion in the leaves, the lighting on the limbs themselves is so yeah, it's glistening from so, from the rain. What is it? Then, it's it's so sleepy hollow. Yeah, yeah. Even yesterday on a partly overcast day, there was all kinds of cool light going through that garden. Mm -hmm. I got a couple of new shots, but uh, this one, this one. Uh, where are you going to hang it, Don? Right here. Can you hold it up there where it's going to be hung? Well, we're going we're gonna to hang it so you can, you can grab that. <clears throat> Don, I was thinking, you know, you got the light switched to oh, a little higher. higher. A little higher. Yeah, I want it to be, you know, I want to catch that light, but How I don't. How is that going don't... with the other, with the other photograph? Are they on the same, same level as Ken's there? I would like mine higher than Ken's. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll leave got, you with that. The guy that took this is a friend of mine too, and, and, and they were kind of rivals in more, more ways than one. In his mind. <laughs> <laughs> you want to measure it? Uh... No, I think I think we could go up a few. it seems like it fits. I think it is about a centimeter of hand in terms. Yes! It's beautiful. What do you think, Tom? I think it's gorgeous. Gorgeous.